television jinx he hasn't had a television success in a long while now and that average there 85 but we know that Wayne is perfectly capable of putting at least 10 probably 15 points on that and Fitton is just the natural is doing what comes naturally and he's winning handsomely the thing is as well Dave is that Mardle so often in matches just needs Nine one little thing doesn't he the spark to light the Mardle flame and that double top double top would have done just that it would have really fired him up yes conversely with a, a slice of bad luck that uh, dices the flame and he's having a much better leg and he really does need to win this leg uh, to stay in touch four down in the race to six so that really six is uh, quite a comeback 160 needs to treble still needs to treble 100 Better leg, wife gone up looking a little bit more composed here. This has been much more like Model the Magnificent. One Why do you require six now to win a leg, he simply has to win. Tops it is for Model. Uh, pull badly, double ten. Oh, this, this would really be a crippler. If Fitton could hit this one for two. That would really hurt, and there's possibilities. Uh, it should be treble ten, surely. Nineteen. Why you require ten? Well, it's now or never. Can't afford to go two breaks down, Wayne Mardle. Way off the mark. Massive dart for Mardle. Six and he's blown it. Now then, if Fitton I takes this out, it's 4-0, but it's two breaks of throw. And is it taxi for Mr. Mardle? Well, that was double top for Les Fitton. And now double ten. Mardle breathes again. Why do you require four? Can't afford to miss that under any circumstance. Double one. The house has never been madder for Mardle. What an important dart. What an important dart that could prove to be. Les Fitton have two to go 4 0 up, and Mardell is still in the hunt. 3 1 down, but only one break of throw. This is what's happening around the boards. Adrian Gray has forced a decider on board six against uh, Dave Askew. And uh, the Pie Man in action over on board two. And uh, winning as well. And over on board eight, we're about to see Gary Mawson in action, last year's runners up. And uh, board four, that should be a great match. Eccles against Toon Griever. Here, Wayne Mardell scrapping for his UK Open existence. Oh, that's impressive. Straight through the letterbox again for Mardle showing nearly keyhole surgery skill on treble 20 and he needs it and he needs it and travels again 60 well only 60 chance here for Fitton to come back do you know Fitton's match in the first round he was 5-3 down against Mark Cox and won the last three legs uh, to earn his place here against Wayne Mardle now then, treble 17 for the ball. Bull's eye, what a finish this would be from Mardle. Oh, a great attempt. Now fitting this to hang on to his throw. Mardle will be back. Remember, Les Fitton missed two darts for a 4-0 lead. Is it about to be 3-2? Well, Wayne has only hit one out of nine attempts at a double. He wants 25 now. So... Marl bounce back. Oh, three for double two. What a funny way of going. Didn't mean that. Didn't mean the double with the first start. Four left, he says. Double two. Critical for Marl. Fantastic start from Marl. He's back in it. He could have been four nil down. He's scrapping. It's three two to Fitton. What a match.
some of the... It's what's happening out and about at the UK Open. Andy Smith just moved into a 4-1 lead over Fullwell. Out on board number two. Clark leading 3-1 against Bowsfield. Tony Eccles, a lot of fans out there for him. Leading Toon Grebe at the moment. Roland Shelton just getting his mash out. Up running on board number six. We'll concentrate on board number one. Can Wayne Mardle battle his way back into this one? Dave Lanning, Stuart Pike. Well, if you're just joining us, Les Fitton missed two darts to go 4 0 up against Wayne Mardle. Is Mardle about to get out of jail? Still a lot of work to do, but it is back on track with Mardle here throwing to level the game at 3 all. 18. Not having. Uh, he's really having a narrow squeak on uh, his doubles. He's had. He's missed what? Uh, seven in the last three legs wow, and really picked up two of those legs so <laughs> I'll be wondering which way his fortune is swinging here but it's a squeaker for Mardle at the moment and uh, Les Fitton is 16. a really tough opponent he's a real scrapper Eight double four zero one is the text number. The players can see the messages around the arena uh, at Bolton, by the way. They are up on all the screens here at the Reebok. Start your messages with the word DART. That's what we're all here for. Just to remind you, coming up on this board, it's Nicholson against Gary Anderson to follow this. Still plenty of twists and turns. Remember, winners of this match going to the third round guarantee themselves at least a thap in prize money and Marble like now with an opportunity to get back on terms double 16 going his own way that is the marker has got a tick on it game shot on the six three nil down three all now the model is all of a sudden at the races oh, that's a clever little shot wasn't it we saw the double that leveled it on double 16 it was like tickling trout 93. and Fitton who is three up is now feeling a blowtorch blast of Mardle on top of his confidence and with his optimism beginning to bubble up again great confidence player model you always feel when things are going his way he's on top of his game he's exciting to watch he's colorful he's spectacular can get depressed but now he's doing a business-like job here he was down it, the luck was against him. remember that double double top uh, to steal a leg when the dark literally gave itself up but now he's back on terms and uh, still not looking at uh, on terms with life yeah, just to expand a little bit on what Rod Harrington was talking about with Dave Clark in, in the build-up to this match, the fact that Mardell has, has just started to try and relax a little bit more. About a month ago, he decided not to practice, except when he wanted to. Half an hour here, half an hour there. Mardell admitted that he felt pressurised into having to do three or four hours a day, because everybody else did, but it just didn't suit him. And it hasn't really ever suited Mardell's game or Mardle's personality you just can't see Wayne Mardle uh, hammering the practice boards terrific dart from Mardle great cover and pressure on Fitton here he was 3-0 up Mardle has got it back level can Mardle here edge ahead for the first time it would be against the throw too so the match would have turned around quite uh, conclusively if 90. he can manage 140 90. Fitton's on 56 can hardly see him missing so Marl now hit, has hit the wrong treble oh, 60 would have left double top so now Fitton to regain the lead 56 16 two clean darts at Double top, taking his time, measuring it like a gunfighter from the old Wild West. Now double ten. Pressure, pure and.